What's going on guys? Doing here bringing you guys another defensive nano blitz out of the Green Bay Packers defensive ebook and this is going to be in the 3-4 odd guys and this is I don't want to say it's universal but you can use this with a few different plays so you have the Sam Mike which is the man to man uh right? You got Sam Mike 2 which is cover 2. You have Sam Mike 3 which is the cover 3 and I believe that there's a Sam Mike 1. Yes, so Sam Mike 1. You can run this with any of those that you want to um it's universal within those groups but the blitz it's pretty lengthy until you can get all of the motions down so what you want to do is you want to base the line pinch the linebackers zone the linebackers re-blitz the left of screen linebacker shift the lineman left shift the right of screen defensive end to the left one step so you're going to move him out like this and then you're going to let him like move him move himself back to his like original spot right if he would just do so, which he doesn't want to do, it seems. Um, and then you're going to re-blitz the left of screen defensive end. So right here. Um, so the play is going to eventually just look like this. Right, guys? And then you're going to be sending just the four people. Um, I think I actually forgot. You want a QB contain. And I think this guy's supposed to be blitzing. If I'm not mistaken. And then what you want to do is you just want to kind of chill right here. And you'll see that you almost get like that screaming A gap like right through the lineman so i'm gonna go over that one more time guys because i think i missed a step like in my own mind um so let's do that again so sam like three gonna base the line pinch linebackers zone linebackers re-blitz left the screen shift lineman left re-blitz uh qb contain we're gonna move him over one and then re-blitz him so the play looks just like this and then you're gonna hold it in and you can see that we come right through the a gap just like that guys and that's how the play is supposed to happen guys it's a very solid blitz it's a very cool blitz um like i said i know it seems lengthy but this is one of the things where you kind of want to go into practice mode or go into play now with no clock on it and just go over the steps over and over again until you're able to do it because once you're able to do it that's when you see that the blitz gets in extremely extremely consistently so what we'll do just for the people that are like, well, if you run the Sam Mike 3, what about the flats? So what we'll do, Sam Mike 2, base the line, pinch the linebackers, zone the linebackers, re-blitz the left, shift lineman left, re-blitz this guy, QB contain, re-blitz this guy, just like that. We're going to move him over one step, and then hopefully we can get it in as easily as we did last time, which we did not. But you guys can see the coverage on the field was absolutely awesome. We had a streak route. We had a... Um, an in route we had a post route a flat route we had all types of routes um so you guys can see that the coverage was pretty on point here guys you can see like the only flaw that we really have on side of the field right now is this guy right here that i'm moving over to so i'm pretty sure even if he attempted to throw that pass he's gonna get blocks plus i wasn't like playing in the beginning of that and i would have been able to get over there in time but the blitz is able to get in guys i know you guys seen like the second time that i ran it what i'll do is i'll run it um I'll run it one more time for you guys so you guys can um can see that it does work and it does get in it consistently um so let me go back into it three four odd sam mike three so again base the line pinch zone re-blitz shift lineman left re-blitz uh move him over one re-blitz qb contain qb contain and then where does it sit like this and then you'll be able to see that again, he almost squeezed right through the A gap. We actually got some nice C gap pressure there. But this is a nice nano blitz, guys. You guys can run online. The cool thing about it is even if it does get stopped, you have really good pressure across the field. The only downfall of the Sam Mike 3 would be the flats. But, I mean, the blitz normally gets in fast enough to where you don't even have to worry about the flats. Um, the good thing about the Sam Mike 2 is that you have the flats covered, but then the deep ball is not really covered. But... All in all, it's a really, really, really good blitz. Um, I know I wasn't able to get it in like first try, guys. So you can, you guys can see right here. This is how the blitz is supposed to get in, and then he loops like right around, and he comes in for the nice sack. I think it might just be the angle or the way that he was coming in the right way, or whatever the case. But normally, if you don't get in that a gap, your right of screen uh, linebacker hole shoot in. Or even like you guys seen that other time, you got some nice C-gap pressure. So I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And if you haven't already, make sure you go follow me on Twitter. But as always, guys, this was D-Money, and I'm out. One more time for you guys so you guys can um, can see that it does work and it does get in consistently. Um, 
So let me go back into it. Three, four odd. Sam Mike three. So again, baseline pinch zone reblitz shift lineman left reblitz. Uh, move him over one reblitz QB contain. QB contain and then where does it sit like this? And then you'll be able to see that again. He almost squeezed right through the A gap. We actually got some nice C gap pressure there. But this is a nice nano blitz, guys. You guys can run online. The cool thing about it is even if it does get stopped, you have really good pressure across the field. The only downfall of the Sam Mike 3 would be the flats. But, I mean, the blitz normally gets in fast enough to where you don't even have to worry about the flats. Um, the good thing about the Sam Mike 2 is that you have the flats covered, but then the deep ball is not really covered. But all in all, it's pretty lengthy until you can get all of the motions down. So what you want to do is you want to base the line pinch the linebackers, zone the linebackers, re-blitz the left of screen linebacker, shift the lineman left, shift the right of screen defensive end to the left one step. So you're gonna move him out like this and then you're gonna let him like move him, move himself back to his like original spot, right? If he would just do so, which he doesn't want to do it seems. Um, and then you're gonna re-blitz the left of screen defensive end. So right here. Um, so the play is gonna eventually just look like this right guys and then you're going to be sending just the four people um i think i actually forgot you want to qb contain and i think this guy's supposed to be blitzing if i'm not mistaken and then what you want to do is just want to kind of chill right here and you'll see that you almost get like that screaming a gap like right through the lineman so i'm going to go base the line pinch the linebackers zone the linebackers reblitz the left shift lineman left Reblitz this guy, QB contain, reblitz this guy, just like that. We're gonna move him over one step, and then hopefully we can get it in as easily as we did last time, which we did not. But you guys can see the coverage on the field was absolutely awesome. We had a streak route, we had a um an in route, we had a post route, a flat route, we had all types of routes. Um, so you guys can see that the coverage was pretty on point here, guys. You can see like the only flaw that we really have on side of the field right now is this guy right here that I'm moving over to. So I'm pretty sure even if he attempted to throw that pass, he's going to get blocks. Plus, I wasn't like playing in the beginning of that. And I would have been able to get over there in time. But the Blitz is able to get in, guys. I know you guys seen like the second time that I ran it. What I'll do is I'll run it. Um, I'll run it one more. What's going on guys, Doing here bringing you guys another defensive nano blitz out of the Green Bay Packers defensive ebook and this is going to be in the 3-4 odd guys and this is, I don't want to say it's universal but you can use this with a few different plays so you have the Sam Mike which is the man to man, uh, right? You got Sam Mike 2 which is cover 2, you have Sam Mike 3 which is the cover 3 and I believe that there's a Sam Mike 1, yes so Sam Mike 1, you can run this with any of the those that you want to um it's universal within those groups but the blitz over that one more time guys because i think i missed a step like in my own mind um so let's do that again so sam like three you're gonna base the line pinch linebackers zone linebackers reblitz left the screen shift lineman left reblitz uh qb contain we're gonna move him over one and then reblitz him so the play looks just like this and then you're gonna hold it in and you can see that we come right through the a gap just like that guys and that's how the play is supposed to happen guys it's a very solid blitz it's a very cool blitz um like i said i know it seems lengthy but this is one of the things where you kind of want to go into practice mode or go into play now with no clock on it and just go over the steps over and over again until you're able to do it because once you're able to do it that's when you see that the blitz gets in extremely extremely consistently so what we'll do just for the people that are like well if you run the sam mike three what about the flats so what we'll do sam mike two 